the train to Qinghai, Tibet need to wear oxygen masks? This is the journey on the Qinghai, Tibet Railway, a marvel of modern engineering. It is the highest and longest railway in the world. The Qinghai, Tibet Railway, also known as the Qingzhan Railway, stretches over 1,956 kilometers from Xining, Qinghai Province, to Lhasa, the capital of Tibet. With an average altitude above 4,000 meters and its highest point at Tangela Pass reaching 5,072 meters, it is the world's highest railway. Over 80% of the route lies above 4,000 meters, where the air is thin and the weather is harsh. For this reason, train carriages are equipped with an oxygen supply system to ensure passenger comfort throughout the journey. To build this masterpiece, China invested an enormous amount of capital. The total cost of constructing the railway is estimated at approximately 4.2 billion US dollars. With the second phase from Golmud to Lhasa, 1.142 kilometers, costing around 330 billion Chinese yuan, approximately 4 billion US dollars at the time. Notably, over 1.1 billion CNY was spent on environmental protection measures making it the largest environmental investment in China's railway construction history. This figure reflects the complexity and scale of the project as engineers faced unprecedented challenges. The construction of this railway was a grueling journey. The project was divided into two phases. The first phase from Xining to Golmud was completed in 1984, and the second phase from Golmud to Lhasa began in 2001 and was inaugurated in 2006. The greatest challenge was the harsh terrain and climate of the Tibetan Plateau. Over 550 kilometers of the route passes through permafrost, which is prone to melting due to temperature changes. To address this, engineers designed cooling pipes to keep the permafrost stable and drove deep piles into the ground to secure the tracks. Temperatures fluctuated from minus 40 degrees Celsius in winter to over 30 degrees Celsius in summer, requiring special construction materials and advanced technology. Moreover, constructing at such high altitudes meant workers frequently faced oxygen shortages. Multiple oxygen supply plants were built along the route to support both workers and the railway system. The route includes over 675 bridges and seven tunnels, including the Kunlun Tunnel, which is 1.686 meters long, and the Feng Huoshan Tunnel at 4.905 meters, the world's highest permafrost tunnel. The Qingshui River Bridge, spanning 11.7 kilometers, is the longest permafrost railway bridge on the plateau. These structures not only demonstrate technical expertise, but also testify to the perseverance required to overcome Tibet's fragile ecosystem. Traveling on the Qinghai Tibet Railway is an unforgettable experience. The trains are designed with modern amenities, including large windows for scenic views, comfortable seats, and cozy sleeping cabins. The Qinghai Tibet Railway is not just a transportation route, but also a symbol of progress and the ambition to conquer nature. With 4.2 billion USD invested and decades of arduous construction, it stands as a testament to human engineering capabilities.